Welcome to Trends News Today. A student gunman opened fire Tuesday at a high school in Southern Maryland, injuring two students before an armed school resources officer intervened, authority said. The gunman was killed, but St. Mary's County Sheriff Tim Cameron said it was not clear if the school officer fired the fatal shot or if the gunman killed himself. The attack began shortly before classes were to begin at Great Mills High, a 1,600-student school 65 miles south of Washington. D.C. Cameron said the gunman shot and wounded a female student in a hallway, also hitting a male student. Our school resource officer was alerted to the events, Cameron said. He engaged the shooter and fired a round, subsequently the shooter fired a round as well. The female student was hospitalized in critical condition and the male student was in stable condition, Cameron said. The resource officer was not injured, Cameron added. This is what we prepare for, this is what we pray we will never have to do, Cameron said. The notion that this can't happen here is no longer a notion. The shooting took place less than a week after some Great Mills students joined tens of thousands of students across the nation in a walkout to protest gun violence. The walkout was spearheaded by survivors of the Valentine's Day rampage at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School in Parkland, Florida. Parkland teens expressed solidarity Tuesday with the students at Great Mills on Twitter. Less than a week ago Great Mills High School students walked out with us to protest gun violence, now they are experiencing it for themselves tweeted Jacqueline Corrin. The state of our country is disgusting. I am so sorry, Great Mills. Tweeted Emma Gonzalez, we are here for you. Students of Great Mills together we can stop this from ever happening again. The shooting also took place less than a month after school principal Jake Heibel told parents that officials had investigated threats of a possible shooting. Law enforcement was contacted, and the threat was not validated. On Tuesday, the school was placed in lockdown immediately following the shooting. There has been a shooting at Great Mills High School, the school district said in a statement on its website. The school is on lockdown and the event is contained. The sheriff's office is on the scene. Additional information to follow. Dozens of law enforcement vehicles surrounded the school on a cold, rainy day. The St. Mary's County Sheriff's Office confirmed it was on the scene and urged parents to gather at another school to reunite with their children. The Bureau of Alcohol, Tobacco and Firearms said special agents from Baltimore and Hyattsville joined the investigation. Governor Larry Hogan said state police were ready to provide support and that his office was monitoring the situation. Our prayers are with students, school personnel, and first responders, he said. We are a very tight-knit community. Cameron said, so now what I would ask our community to do is pray for the victims. What do you think? If you like this news, please share this with your friends. Don't forget to comment below the box and subscribe our channel.